There's an old workhorse right there. The old International. All right, it's Saturday, June 9th. Among other things, I got the farmer setting up hay bales around all the blinds. Now we're talking, man. We're making decades worth of changes in one year. Okay, and here is just one of seven um, rotten hay bales by each of the seven food plots. So I try to look ahead and put them in decent wind positions now so I don't have to move them if, and I don't have to move them much. So here we go. You got water and hole here and the primary cover is going to be down in the creek bottom where it's all pine planted right now. All right, so here you can set up a ground blind and you can shoot towards the watering hole and here's the food plot right here. That is north. So most of my stands I set up for north or west winds. Um, not for, you know, colder weather is when you're going to have better luck on food plots. So if you got a north wind here, you got your food plot, that's cool, and your watering hole, your wind is coming down here, that's all good. So it's a really nice setup. So put a ground blind right next to the uh, hay bale and away you go. And look at this, it's raining. It is raining right now. The only thing I haven't got done was I missed two food plots for fertilizing. But I'll take that. Let's get a good soaking. My goodness, that would be wonderful. I think he takes one across the creek and then goes back for the second one. It's a pretty steep crossing there.
right here. Um, right there. Perfect. One time, I don't mind standing out in the rain right now.